Alrighty, good morning and welcome back to another episode. I am Bearded Bassin and we're on a little bit of a mission today. Uh, it's Saturday and we're headed out to the Delta, see if ramps are still open. From the latest reports that I've heard, ramps are still open, any private owned lawn tramp is still open out here on the Delta. It's too hard to close them all down. Can't really say anything about the Rona on the channel because I got demonetized on my last video saying that there was a cure for it. So we're out here at uh, Flying J right now, getting the rig gassed up. And I got a new game for you guys. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how much gas that I have burned on the last trip. Now, you guys can leave a comment down below how much gas you think I burned last trip. Who knows, maybe I'll, uh, whoever's closest to it all, I'll pick a prize. Maybe a pack of baits or something that I feel like has been working recently out here on the Delta, and I'll send it to you guys. So, leave a comment down below how much gas you think I've burned. All right, 11.8 gallons. Who guessed that right there? Let me know. Right, just made it over here. As you can see, BNW, it's open. I'm on the water, Saturday, April something. I don't know what day it is. Yep, I'm still working as usual, out here fishing on the weekends. Um, let's see if I can figure something out. So whoever was closest to the gas down below, um, I'm gonna reach out to you guys and yeah, send you guys a pack of baits or a bait or something like that. Um, but yeah, 11.8 gallons, that's how much fuel I burned last weekend uh, fishing for a day. So not not crazy, but I did do a lot of running. So we're out here, just gonna go fishing today, see if I can't figure something out. Um, we've got some weather moving in, uh, it should be raining halfway throughout the day. Uh, see if that's gonna get the reaction bite going. And man, I, I think we're gonna get into them today. Today feels like that kind of day. So without further ado, I'm gonna sit down, shut up and uh, get to fishing. All right, first spot of the day. Now, when last week, the water temp when I first launched was almost 60 degrees. This morning, 55.7. That is a significant change. I mean, that's freaking three or four degree difference in a matter of a week of it dropping. So I don't know what the heck these fish are gonna be doing. I don't know if they're gonna be lock jawed or just uncooperative but we're starting today on a rock bank um, this has got really good grass on it good water depth a lot of holes for fish to sit in spawn in um, I'm just gonna burn down the bank with a chatterbait and see if can't just get bit um, I think the name of the game today is gonna be cycling through baits um, a lot of the times when I'm out here on the Delta I get really stuck on one bait one bite um, oh, that was a big fish that just followed into the boat. Um, get stuck on one bait, one bite, and just try to search the delta for that. But there are so many different ways to catch fish out here. Um, so I'm going to be cycling through baits and just seeing if I can put something together that is enjoyable for you guys to watch. So stay tuned. Spot number one did not pan out. 30 minutes, no bites. 
Time to move. Spot number two, um, tide is really out right now. It's a big offshore grass flat right here. I'm just gonna go through and quickly flip it, punch it, whatever you wanna call it, and uh, see if there's any fish out here. Gosh, I hope there is. Hope I can zip. This looks too good. Gonna have to throw a frog. Gonna have to throw a frog so I can cover more water. All right, Kermit. This looks too good, gotta throw a frog. Scared something there. <sighs> All right. Nothing on the frog. Bummer. Nothing on the frog. Back to punching, back to flipping. All right, man, today is not off to a great start. Hydrilla grass flat, no fish, no fish, no fish. That was a fish. Bit off my tail. See, that was the gayest hook set that you could ever do. Because I didn't think it was a fish, but I felt a little pressure. Set the hook like a weenie, and it bit my tail off. Well, two bites on the rock bank with hydrilla. Not sure if the pattern is steady enough to keep going down this bank, but... The tide is so far out right now, it's not really leaving me much choice than to just punch, you know, and flip submerged grass or exposed grass, whatever you want to call it. I mean, I guess I could throw a chatterbait on the outside, but that's just not really that consistent. This is like the most consistent thing that I can think of right now is these fish are going to be, you know, sucked into this grass right now and it's just finding maybe the right color combination or weight combination or I don't know they got to start showing me something much 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 later there you go there's a fish First fish of the day, finally. And it's a giant. Just an absolute giant. Well, made a bait change over the rip bait. First fish. It's been a good two hours that I've been fishing and I haven't had a bite. Hopefully, this means they'll eat a jerk bait. Not even a keeper, little rat. There's a fish. Not a very big one, but. Wow. About the smallest fish you ever did see right there.
Oh, ate it at the boat. There we go, that's a good one. Finally, look at that, that thing ate it. Look how this fish ate this bait. Head first, down the throat. That's how you wanted to eat a jerk bait. Oh, let's see if I can get this thing unhooked without getting myself. Well, first decent fish of the day. Probably about a, just, just about a three pounder, three and a quarter. Not so bad. Ate it right at the boat. It's been it's been tough trying to figure out these fish. I haven't really found them, um, but we're starting to put it together. Uh, been jumping around, tying on different baits, and finally the uh, jerk bait's what's getting it done. So I'm gonna keep tossing that thing, and hopefully, hopefully we can find more a couple more to go with it. That's why. Old stripey. Old stripey. Now. Don't you do this to me. Just let me help you. Just like that. That one was up real shallow, like behind the trough, real shallow. That's a good sign. Fish number three, another two and a half pound fish. Not so bad. just got home and it was not the day that I was looking forward to. Um, I thought that the weather and the rain was really gonna pick the bite up. The areas that I was fishing, I mainly stayed in one area and fished it all day from, and most of the day it was on a low tide. It didn't start switching until right when I got off the water. So um, yeah, it was a little slow. Caught a couple decent ones, nothing huge. Um, didn't have a wide open bite. I know there's a bite out there right now. A lot of big fish are chewing wake baits and big glide baits and stuff like that, but it's, you gotta commit to it. You definitely have to commit to it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, it was a lot of fun, um, even though I got soaked and drenched and rained on the whole time. It was still good, and I just wanna let you guys know if you've made it this far, I've got something cool, something really special. I'm gonna show you guys right here. I just created my first website. So um, if you guys go to beardedbassin.com, you guys can check out the website and there's a link to a shop. That's right, I got my first run of t-shirts on there. Um, it's a standard black shirt with an old school kind of logo, um, circle logo. You guys can check it out on the website. Limited supply, only 50 of them, but I'm going to start making t-shirts. So um, whether it's going to be Delta themed or Lake themed or my brand themed, uh, I'm going to start pumping out some some stuff for you guys so you guys can wear some uh, some sweet gear while you're out on the water. Represent the channel, represent the Delta, the whole nine yards. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and now visit the website so that you guys can get a t-shirt. And remember, like I always say, any cast can be a giant. Peace.
never do it. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. Yeah.